morning guys uh, I'm on my way to work it's cold and hang tight and you'll see how what I do and how my day goes guys all right guys so I'm gonna be letting you guys know what I'm gonna be doing this weekend um, so there's two dilemmas to what I'm planning to do tomorrow the first dilemma is that probably Alvaro will work which I have a gut feeling that he will because um, he didn't work yesterday and right now pretty much they're giving him the lousy routes that nobody wants yes I'm gonna say it and if even if he gets pissed off but you know he's barely starting a job you know so it's like at my job they're giving me everything that you know the girl that's in the front, I bet she's giving me everything that she doesn't want to do or that they're going to hand over to me. But, you know, it's pretty much things that they don't want to deal with anymore. So, you know, when you start a new job, like they kind of give you everything that they don't want. Well, um, I'm not talking smack on my job because I love my job right now. Like um, so far, I have no complaints, seriously. Um, anyways, the second dilemma is that the weather, I don't want it to be how it is today, like high winds and if there's rain, um, I can do an outdoor um, pro project like I um, like I would you usually do. But um, yeah, guys, I'm gonna be doing a Christmas not I'm not gonna say Christmas a holiday lookbook. I'm so excited for that. Why am I making my hands like this? But you guys know I put my heart and soul to my lookbooks, even if it's one look, even if it's two looks, even if it's three looks, even if it's four looks, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I put everything into my lookbooks, guys. Um, even my videos, my vlogs, I put my heart and soul into them. Um, I am that passionate, guys, and I really want you guys to see that. Um, every single outfit that I put together... Um, you guys always ask me, like, Miriam, where do you get all these ideas? And um, do you, like, get ideas from other people? Honestly, guys, I was thinking of saying, yes, I do get ideas from some. No, guys, like, every single outfit that I put together. Yeah, sometimes you guys might see some, like, one of my outfits that looks like something you've seen before. But I feel like sometimes I do do that. Like, I see something and then I kind of, like, put it into my own idea. But... Um, if I do do that, I always say I get it. I got inspired by this, but honestly, guys, like all of the outfits that I've done, they've came from here. Like, um, the way I put my outfits together, I'm going to suggest this to you guys. Like today, let's say, for example, this vest, um, I look at the colors, I look at the texture of the clothing, and I just go, okay, what can I envision, what do I envision this vest with? I'm just like, okay, it's chilly outside, long, long sleeve, um, something a little thick, and I love, love blouses that are really loose. Probably not because I don't love myself, I, I don't love my body, but because I know that I don't feel comfortable in my stomach area right now, and, and I don't like my stomach you know flapping out so um then i say do i want to wear leggings do i want to wear jeans do i want to like depending on what i have on top right here i figure out the bottom you know so i i put some jeans on then i put my little boots on so that's how i envision my outfit so i grab one piece the main piece and then i start you know just putting in details so like I said today's vest led to my long sleeve led to my jeans my black jeans led to my boots so I pretty much like let's say it's a dress um if it's a dress I just depending how the dress is I accept accessorize it and then um yeah guys like every single outfit that I show you guys comes from me and I am going to give myself credit because I put my heart and soul into it. And I that sounds selfish. That sounds like, oh my God, Mary, I'm like, you know, you're being cocky and stuff. No, guys, like I really want you guys to know that I'm passionate about showing you guys and giving you guys ideas. I never show off my outfits. I want you guys to get ideas and get inspired. That is my 
whole purpose of me making lookbooks, of me making, um, you know, makeup looks. I never want to. Don't ever think that if you recreate one of my looks, one of my um, clothing looks or one of my makeup looks that I say, oh, she copied me. No, I say I honestly feel amazing that you guys got inspired by me. That's why I want you guys to get inspired. Um, and that's why I do what I do. The money maker, a.k.a. the go-getter. This is my office from now on. You know, it's cool because you're driving by yourself all day. Ain't nobody bugging you. Ain't nobody told you what to do. I love it. You can work at like, your own pace. Cool. I'll show you guys inside the warehouse in a little bit. It gets crazy in there. Okay, guys, so I'm leaving the warehouse now. It is almost nine. And this is what it looks inside. All those vans pick up all their stuff like that. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see, but there you go. The thing that sucks today, I'm gonna run up the mountain towards the mountains today and uh, I gotta do some of the stocking. And my zip codes are all messed up. Well, it's going to be a long day. I'm going to get going, though. And organize. About to have lunch. Hey, hey. Okay, tell them. <laughs> tell them. <laughs> he said that he couldn't be in my, uh, huh? He said that he couldn't be in my vlog unless I promoted his, his Instagram. Oh, yeah. So he doesn't want to do it now. Like, what the heck? Mmm. All right, guys. You guys need to tell me what did you guys think about the beans? Oh, they were fantastic. Oh, they, they were, were fantastic. <laughs> For her mom. <laughs> it was excellent. They were great. Yeah. Yeah, they were good. What? Okay. Why? Because I didn't make them. Hey guys, so we are ready to leave. Got all my packages in order. My mom just left the house. You know, she left my, she made some lunch, some sandwiches and whatnot, some of the good stuff. Then we have Gatorade. Um, have my Rockstar ready to go. My scanner, my beach pill, that little Bluetooth thing is a lifesaver. And yeah, guys, ready. Oh, that's my mountain stuff. All the back there is stocked in. So let me mount this thing on here. Sorry about all the commotion. We're ready to roll. Ready right to roll. I know. My baby gonna like my ideas, you know what I mean? Like, ugh. I know she's gonna start wanna she's gonna wanna vlog with uh the GoPro now. Okay, so let's get our route going here. I'm going up to the mountain first because the you know it's further. Okie dokie. Well, this is our next stop, and it is it is ten o'clock. We'll see what time we get done. Hopefully, it'll be an early day. The thing that sucks is that I got different. It's forty three minutes away. Thing that sucks is that I got routes in Stockton, but they're all over the place. I gotta go one side of town, the other side of town. So. <laughs> Oh, we just 
don't remember, but I came over here the other day. Look at those houses. Okay, I don't know if you can see it because of the glare of the sun. But those houses, they're on a hill. They're just stupid clean. I gotta deliver some packages right there right now. I would love to live over here. Can you guys see that? Oh my god. House. It's a lake. Man, it's cold. I feel really spoiled because they give me a hoodie. A card with um, tickets to the movies. Don't doubt me, babe. You make me want to change. Break my bed to make me want to stay. I can't back me, babe. You make me love the pain. Break my bed. So I'm in Lake Comanche. I will be fishing this lake in about two weeks. There's guys fishing off of uh, little uh, little dinghies. But I'm gonna be here with my boat. And I got a delivery right now for them. So, cool, I get to pee. You know, I get to see where I'm gonna launch my boat and all this crap. It's a pretty big lake. These, are, these little things right here are just like outlets of it. So, kind of got directions to where to go. In the entrance so they just told me to follow the the, the road so I'm following it and we'll see this place looks beautiful I can camp out here I might be doing that I'll bring the van I'll bring this van bring an air mattress the generator everything I'll come back here for the for the night this is the only good spot the whole day because most of the stuff that I have is for that for this spot. So we'll see where now what happens. I'm kind of lost though, this place is big. Green. So I came to the office and asked and dang look at this. Look at all these fish. They're all trout. Look at that big mama right there. Wow. I'm definitely coming here. Definitely. I'm after those things right there though. One thing I hate is when my room is dirty, guys. Like, I like doing my bed every morning. And literally, my sister didn't do the bed or anything. I don't know where she's at. I know she had finals today, but it frustrates me when my room is looking like this. But I'm not going to let that kill my day. Anyways, I'm going to start record uh, recording. I'm going to start filming right now. Um, I'm pretty excited. I need to take the makeup off from this morning. Um, that's why I didn't put any... I make up on that's more like it this is how I like my room guys nice and clean and the carpet very vacuumed now I'm content now let's get this filming started before I continue I want to say thank you to one of my bosses at my new job like seriously like uh, i'm so thankful guys like it's not that i want to show off or nothing but seriously like they've been 
so sweet to me um every single person there has been so nice to me like ever since i got there so i'm really thankful i don't take anything for granted and um also they give me a hoodie too and i just feel really really like honored to be part of them now and honestly i didn't want to share where i worked um before because i don't know how i was gonna do but now after pretty much showing them after two weeks um how i i work and everything like i think things are going pretty good so i'm happy to share and i don't know if you guys had already seen like you know if you guys already knew cool but um i work for a costco fire protection we're in a fire alarm and sprinkler company so um there's two sides of the building but it's so cool like everybody's so genuine 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 man i could never say that word um everybody's very very nice um i feel thankful and every single co-worker from there is just awesome and um I'm, i've been having a really really good um experience there so we came to michael's make creativity happen i don't know um i came for some a few kind of uh, i came for a few stuff that i need real quick <laughs> oh my god look at those hats guys they're actually baskets <laughs> so freaking cute that's where that's where Santa puts his presents. He has a one. Oh man. So, um, I was looking up what time Michael's closed today, and they close at eleven. And I was like, what the heck? And then Alvaro was like, I can't believe. Here, babe, can you vlog me, please? He's like, I can't believe they they open. Babe, can you not do that? <laughs> He's like, I can't believe they open till 11, huh, babe? Stop! I wonder if they still figure here. No, you quarter like that. Can you see my hood to my, my jacket? Costco fire protection. Hey, we're proceed. Hey. Anyways, um, <laughs> look, guys, there's a there's a camera, so they're gonna see me that I'm all dancing and stuff. Oh look, the soccer girl, um, the soccer girl fans. Yeah, but I don't know which ones to get these, though. These, these, That's too much. It's ten bucks. Oh, I have coupons. I want to see you do stand to be big no? How much were these? Two dollars. All the time I forget my money. Two dollars. No, no. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, these are cute too. They're like actual diamonds. Oh, so they're like actual diamonds. Let me see. Mm. Look, guys, I saved. Like five dollars today, huh, babe? Yep. I saved like five dollars at Michaels. So whenever you come to Michaels, I've always or Joanne's or anywhere. Siempre le he dicho Alvaro que busca cuponcitos, Alvaro, busca que busca cupones porque están allí online y nosotros ni en cuenta. Pero yo siempre he aprendido en el en la Michaels y el Joanne's. But saben quién me enseñó a agarrar cupones? You know who taught me how to get coupons? My mother, because my mom always tells me, oh, buscame un cupón, buscame un cupón. Like, no es que seamos culos, it's not that we're being cheap, it's just that saving money doesn't hurt anyone, right, babe? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, remember that vlog where, um, this day, I was like, oh yeah, Alvaro's not gonna see, hopefully Alvaro doesn't see that I came to the mall again. Oh my god, he saw the vlog and literally the next day he was like, Fuiste al mall otra vez! Eres una dicta! <laughs> you guys should taste it for good. What is it? Let me see. Candy cane Hershey's. Candy cane Hershey's oven? Let me taste it. It smells hella nasty. Got the 
gear going. Got the stuff for the drone. <sighs> then all of the cameras for tomorrow. What was it? Well, <laughs> dumb. The other camera, I have it on my hand. <laughs> Anyways, guys, but um, we got everything going. Oh, and also the GoPro, but I think Alvaro took it. I think he did. Um, today I'm going to be combining um, what he vlogged and man I always want to put this here y nunca lo puedo poner. so today I'm going to be combining um, whatever he vlogged with the vlog that I did so I hope that today's vlog is a little more interesting and you guys enjoy it so let me know in the comments down below what you what you like better like if i vlog by myself or if he vlogs with me as well okay seriously alvaro was not joking about vlogging like he has literally 20 clips <gasps> i gotta see what i can use in it what i can't all right guys we're gonna call it a night i really hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below what your favorite part of today's vlog was. And I will see you guys on the next vlog tomorrow. Love you guys. Good night. Feeling the sun.